and it's uh, greetings from up north. You can see, see that it's uh, really winter here, so uh, I'll be giving you some, some points about things going on here here up, up in northern Europe. So here you see uh, what uh, northern Europe is composed of. We have, for example, the Icelandic Society of Alcoholism and other addictions, who has been affiliated with ISAM for, for a very long time. Uh, and uh, and also, for example, the Lithuanian. Yona, your your voice is, is sort of interrupted. I'm not sure what is the problem with your internet connection, but your voice seems a little bit interrupted. I mean, is there any other network that you can use, or I mean, it's it's understandable, but it's just a little bit kind of interrupted. At least what we have here right now. All right. Is this any better? I just took my headphone off. No, you're still you're still breaking up, but. Why don't you go ahead? I'll, I'll, I'll try with that video. Let's see if the bandwidth would, would hold. Is this any better? Not very much, but I mean, go go ahead, you know, I think that there is some like an interruption in your sorry. internet connection, but we can we can we can hear you. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Sorry for for this. So here you see the associations or, or societies in Northern Europe that are already affiliated with ISAM and Hamed just updated a few days ago that uh, probably there will be more, more affiliations to come that are in, in the process. Some of the countries in the region do not have uh, specific associations, for example, Estonia, I saw, saw Celia Olko here from Estonia, but um, uh, they, they do not have a specific society. So the process is moving forward. Can I have the next slide, please? So these are some uh, some updates updates that have, have been going on in the region. Uh, the Lithuanian Association is, is quite active and just uh, informed me that they had had this really impressive a series of workshops, 50 hours in total, in collaboration with ISA. ISA that uh, reached 84 residents from psychiatry and family medicine, and a whole a bunch of uh, other colleagues, uh, professionals in the field, uh, access these material, materials and uh, uh, co-chairs of the training committee of ISA and Professor Cornelius de Jong, and Professor Barb Brewers were, were uh, uh, among the trainers that were leading, leading this, this workshop. And, and this is really, really interesting and exciting. And they're uh, preparing to present results and evaluations in uh, Istanbul by 2024. Sorry about the sound, about connection. Let's make do, I guess. So, uh, Shalini already uh, pointed to this. So, uh, Dufus uh, and Jorgen Ramnes led uh, uh, a really nice study about uh, addiction uh, specialist training in Europe. Uh, and this was published in European Addiction Research just uh, recently. Uh, we have Jorgen uh, from from, from uh, Sweden who uh, give a commentary and our, our Finnish commentary on this is just has just been accepted and it is going to be published in just uh, the coming weeks. Next please. So some upcoming activities. We have uh, identified contacted local experts in, in our region and, and we are uh, expecting to increase collaboration in this region. There is a collaborative project about screening of harmful alcohol use in the general hospital setting. Uh, in collaboration with Norway, Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania, this will be led by the Oslo University, University Hospital, and this has been uh, instigated. And uh, we will uh, be part participating, as Carol was from the US uh, said, in, in, in ASA meeting in, in Dallas. Uh, with reference to the symposium and of addiction care in carceral settings. And we will also be uh, hosting a symposium, chairing a symposium in the International Conference of Behavioral Addictions in Gibraltar in July. Next, please. I would like to take this chance to plug our 
uh, national conference, which is just coming up this week. We have, uh, for the first time, an international uh, uh, afternoon, if you will, with, with expert talks on stimulant use disorder. And uh, this is something that we have done before, and we welcome every everyone to join. This is completely free. Just sign up and, and join this coming Friday, Friday afternoon, fish time. Next, please. So some other upcoming activities. We we will be participating, of course, in this General Assembly and also the one, one hopefully in Istanbul and, and our national conference with the, uh, the, the live webinar, international webinar is, is coming up. And uh, uh, there have been talks about a possible regional meeting in the coming years uh, hosted by uh, uh, Iceland. And our application, as, as Dr. Ahmad just in the beginning, uh, told us that uh, our, our 2029 ISM International Conference has been accepted, and we are really excited about that. So.